Hey guys, Jack Jr. here, and today we are going to be doing the ice cream magic, and my favorite flavor that I would probably do if I had all the stuff to do it would be the mint chocolate chip, but, you know, as it shows on the recipes right here, um, we're just going to do strawberry, it's a simple one, and it's my second favorite. So, uh, just come on in and I'll show you the ingredients. We have sugar, salt, vanilla extract, frozen strawberries, the item that we're going to be using, obviously, um, heavy whipping cream and strawberry syrup. We've got the spoon, then we've got the main lid, then the sort of a backup lid. Then you've got the main bowl where you're going to be eating your ice cream from, also called the freezing bowl. And then you got this little measuring cup inside here. I'm not sure what that can be used for. But then parents, once your kid's done making this ice cream, you can make a nice coffee for the morning, get your day started. The first thing you do is there's a little line in here. It's pretty easy to see. You just fill it up. You just fill it up with ice. Now we add in about four tablespoons of salt. There we go. It should be good. And then we do that about three more times. Since it would take forever to get four tablespoons of water from the sink into this cup without spilling, I decided to just do a bottle of water. That way it's a lot easier. Now you place the freezing bowl over the ice chamber. Now we're going to make our ice cream ingredients. We got a quarter cup of heavy whipping cream, a quarter teaspoon of vanilla extract right there, should do it. Now we've got half a tablespoon of sugar, sugar the best part. Then we've got one tablespoon of strawberry syrup. Mix this well. Now, before you continue stirring, you're gonna, once you get a color like this, you're gonna wanna drop in a few pieces of frozen strawberry just to give it that realistic strawberry flavor. Now we've got all our good deliciousness right there. Then you see that little fill line? You should be able to see it. If not, you know, you'll see it when you buy it. Um, so, then you're gonna make it to the fill line. It's okay if you get some strawberry chunks in there, just be careful not to get too much. Faster, please. And we're good. Got one strawberry chunk in there. It should work perfectly. Now you're ready to get to the fun part for the little kids right now. Gonna get them really active. First you have to make sure it's all nice and tied on so they don't make a huge mess. Put the second one on just to reinforce it. And guess what? It's shaking time. Let's do this. Now let's take a look at this bad boy. Wow, it actually turned out well. And also it, it says that if it's a little loose and you think it should be a little more, to stir it to your liking. And then, you know, you can take a bite like this. Okay, now that we've probably decided, yeah, it's a success. Now it matters for the kid mind to know if it tastes good, even though I'm 13. That's really good. And the fact that I got some of the strawberries in there too, makes it even better. The best part is that it's fresh and it's homemade. I'm Jack Jr. and my dad will see you on the next Cooking with Jack. Today we're going to do be doing my favorite flavor, flav, take two, thousand. <laughs>